But now that we know that it is called YAML deserialization, what we can do is we can modify our search a little bit. So YAML deserialization, and then we can try payload all the things just to see if we can get anywhere with payload all the things. And here we do have Python deserialization. Here's that pickle.loads that we were talking about just previously that we saw the error for. And we can see here that it does have a few options. So we could try to do something like this, which basically allows us to use the subprocess and then the check uh, the check output function of subprocess, and then we'll supply the arguments here. So copying it on over to the website, we can click link and we can see here that we do have remote code execution. So looking through some of this, we could see that there is a flag.txt here, and we could just do something along the lines of cat, and then inside of the next quote, we could do flag.txt and that will give us the flag for this challenge.